If you're wondering what it's like to catch a Josh Allen pass, just ask Ray Ray McLeod. You always got to have your hands ready because you break your finger quick. People be like, dang, he really just threw that? He put it in the holes that that's not there, but he'll, he'll find a way to put it in there. Allen's first career touchdown pass has gotten plenty of noise, but so has the catch as McLeod fights for a roster spot. Some you live for, you know, some you, you work for, some you grind for, and it's some that we always work on that practice, getting hit when the ball's coming. He's a young player that continues to get better with each practice. He made some plays in the scrimmage a couple, uh, I guess a week ago or so now, a week and a half ago, and he made some plays to your point um, the other night, so that was good to see. He's a third generation Ray Ray, and while his father never played in the NFL, he did coach him growing up. So did Hall of Famer Derek Brooks, who McLeod sees as another father figure. And he ended up being my defensive coach from about fifth grade to high school. Ever since then, he always told me, you got ability to go to the next level and everything I do, you just got to work and uh, stay consistent. And I know he played in the league for forever. So when he talks, I listen. We may talk about stuff that I may not talk about with my dad, just some certain levels, just a major blessing. You know, everybody don't have that. The Bills six round pick was also blessed with speed, but not necessarily height. How tall are you? 5'10". They have you at 5'9". I know they got, they pushed me down. I had braids and stuff, they pushed me down that day, I remember. How tall are you with the hair? Probably like 6'2". McLeod doesn't worry about his size, though. He laughed, adding, I play big. With the Bills Report from St. John Fisher College, I'm Dan Fates.